And we can't go back there. Oh, we can. Now everything's lit up. Oh, jeez. Notes on Sigurd's progress. Isolation. I began with sensory deprivation. No light, no touch, no warmth, no voices. To unlock the god within, the man called Sigurd must retreat into the shadows. His true self may emerge in time. When I'm bred, that is all I have allowed this beautiful man. He is something to behold. When he curses my name, I feel the power in his voice. When he struggles against his bonds, I hear the squeal of leather straps and the grind of iron on iron. He has fight in him, but to win this war against himself, he must relent. Sigurd does not yet accept that I have his best interests in mind, that I have taken him so that he may become his best self. He fights this idea, balks at it. And yet, I note of a certain hesitation in his voice when he speaks. He talks as if a man being talked over, as a voice interrupts, as if voices interrupt the river of his thoughts. It is working. Blood flows slowly from the forearm. A few small cuts produce a steady but manageable stream. Weeks upon weeks and very little progress, Sigurd has lost weight and physical strength, but his will is strong. And though he is beset by visions, he has not allowed them to take him over. It is time for a different approach. Sigurd withstands heat and pressure quite well. I have made no permanent alterations as yet, but that may have to change. An insight. A phrase he screamed as the vice tightened around his head. I am the Lord of D Justice. You will answer to me or die. This puts me on a better path. I know what I must do. I know what he must lose. Alright. So I guess it is Sigurd's arm. Um... Yeah, I, I didn't realize, like, it had been that long since we last saw him. Like, I thought maybe it was a few days, maybe a couple weeks, but... I think earlier they said it's been like a month, maybe more than that. <laughs> and I was like, what? Oh, yeah. Did I read this? Yes. Alright. So now... Now what do we have to do? Let's take a look. Um, not really sure. We have to go back to the settlement. And report to Ranvi. Okay. You know, I'm kind of tempted to do some raiding. Maybe explore this place. And yeah, maybe we'll do some exploration. Why not? Since we're here. Alright, let's not run into a wall. Uh, there's a bunch of people here. Alright. How do I get out of here? Somebody point me towards the door. I found the door. Alright. Uh, well, I don't know if I found the door, but I found a door. Alright, we're out of here. So first thing I want to do is grab this wealth that's over here. Dude, how far away is this freaking wealth? Oh, son of a bitch, there's multiple wealth. Wealths? I don't know. This will get messy. There's a flighting thing, maybe? Not sure. I don't remember what the mask means, and I don't really care too much. Alright, so I think it's over there, probably. There's somebody with a key. Does this guy know God's I'm here? here He's going to know. Alright, maybe I can go through here. Mm. Well. Uh, I don't know how to get in there. Did 
They're gonna get suspicious. They're gonna see the body. Well, I was trying to spam R1, hoping that I can get an assassination off as I was falling, but apparently not. So, I'm going to assume I have to find a different key besides the one that guy has. Either that or, or I can shoot a lock somewhere, but I doubt it. Damn it. Uh-oh. I mean, is he the only one with a key? Because I'm not seeing any other keys around here. Uh-oh. Dude, they're all just, like, totally where. Oh shit. Why did that thing blow up? Hey, an arrow in the dog. So slow. So slow? What the hell are you talking about? We're not going to stealth our way through this. But that doesn't really matter now, does it? Um. Yeah. I don't know what to talk about. Dude, this is what I'm talking about. It's like... It's hard to figure out what I want to talk about. Um, I don't know. That's why I should save these like topics for you know these sections where nothing's really happening. Not so much for that. Oh, look at that. Oh, it went right through a shield, too. What a loser. What? Did you see that? Because I was in the air, my arrow was able to, like, slow down. Or, you know, time was able to slow down. I didn't know that was a thing. Ouch. Let me see. Oh. Yeah, it does slow down time when you're, like, jumping off of things. I didn't know that. If I could just press the right button. And actually shoot the arrow. Can I just... Can I attack? Man, it, I've been like... I've been feeling like some of my button presses just don't register. Ooh. 
Who is this guy? Good day. What is your name? I am Eivor, of the Raven Clan. And are you a flighter? When the mood strikes. Do you wish to flight with me? Oh, no, certainly not. I don't engage in such things. Haven't a head for it. My brother, however, he is quite proficient. Okay. Ah, then you wish to compete with me. I should mention, my brother has taken a strict vow of silence. If you wish to flight, I will translate and relay his verses. I think I understand. Good. Interesting. Hark! To those gathered round, wave your hands and rejoice. I shall trounce this poor fool without use of my voice. Such is his challenge. Do you wish to face him? How does he know what he's saying? I'll happily challenge you. Sorry, him. Yeah, we'll go small bet. I don't really care Here too are. much. My bet. Good. Now remember, it is not me you are flighting. I am but a conduit for his words. I will keep this well in mind. Hmm. Good. He is ready. Come you closer, friend Eivor, and lend me your ear. The most cutting of flights from my mouth you'll not hear. But by proxy I'll call you a milksop and boor. This is your bed, I've got to undo it. Uh, though you speak through another, your writing's still poor. Though you speak through another, your flighting's still poor. Your body is withered, your garments absurd. I'll topple you over with nary a word. I'm devoted to flights, though to silence avowed. Devoted to winning, or haven't you heard? Though you chose choose to be quiet, your folly is loud, your simpleton and a fool, and you should never be proud. Though you choose to be quiet, your folly is loud. Oh my! <laughs> your visage is ghastly. I'm cowed by your stink. I should like to write more, but you're not worth the ink. So, a last parting phrase. You're as dim as they come. I will easily crush you beneath my thumb. Uh, with such drivel to speak, I see why you keep mum. You're a waste of good quiet. Go choke on. Um. With such drivel to speak, I see why you keep mum. I don't know. With such drivel to speak, I see why you keep mum. Very fine work. As an impartial observer, I must say you won. Thank you. My brother has a few parting words. You have bested me squarely and thus won the day. So take what you've earned now and hurry away. I will. Farewell to you both. Alright. Uh, anybody want to explain what's going on here? I thought he was taking a vow of silence. Uh, apparently not. I mean, I don't know what a vow of silence entails. Like, I don't know if maybe praying doesn't count but i don't know a little bit suspicious of that one but hey we got more charisma so it's fine i don't like the flighting too much the only thing it it, it helps with like the actual gameplay or i guess it just makes conversations easier, I guess. And that's it. I don't know. It helps out with the main story. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. This place is heavily guarded. Yeah, 
I'm like, I have no idea how to like get into any of these places because they're all locked and there's only one key that I see. And it's this guy. But how do you get in there? I mean, there's two locked doors. Well, I, ha I have an idea now. See, I saw these earlier, and I'm like, maybe he can blow something up. I also thought I saw a rock wall somewhere around here, and I did. Yeah, is it? Oh, hello. Does he just not know I'm here? Because if I can get an assassination on him, that would be great. Even if I only do a little bit of damage, it's better than nothing. Where'd he go? Where did he go? Did he leave? Oh, he's right there. That's eh, not going to do anything. As long as he doesn't look up here. Ooh. Oh, look at that. Done. <laughs> uh, yes. Yes. So do we have like a master key now where I can just go anywhere I want? I hope so. I think so. Alright, what's in this chest? Nickel. Take it. Impassioned plea to the venerable captain of Dover. Harold, you know I do not ask this lightly. We need your protection. The situation with the Viking Raiders has become so dire that I can no longer trust the treasury of Canterbury. Will not fall into their murderous hands. I am driven to protecting it with my own sword. If you care anything for me, and your beautiful letters and poems led me to believe you do, send us men. The captain of your heart, Edwin. Edwin. There's no D on the end of that. Oh yeah, that's one of the things I wanted to talk about. Um, so in that cutscene where we discovered like Sigurd's arm, um, I did notice that I had accidentally like pressed triangle too many times, and then the skip button appeared on the screen, and it, you have to hold circle to skip a cutscene. So that means I probably didn't miss a cutscene earlier, uh, because even if I was spamming X there would have been a button prompt on the screen that would have, there would have been a button prompt on the screen that would have said skip hold circle to skip so uh yeah i don't think i missed a cutscene earlier which is good uh zealous writings we are the pre we are the protectors of the blessed augustine of canterbury our mission continues well we have sent many a heathen to the feet of their false gods Every blow upon them is a righteous one, and we will not stop until every apostate is burning on a pyre. Okay, what's next? Is there anything else around here? Probably like a bunch of wealth somewhere around here. Yeah, there's a bunch of wealth like over, over there. I think. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. I, I kind of... Actually, I could probably uh, move this. I've been trying to think of, like, what to do with my videos and stuff. Like, I, I don't know exactly what I want to do, but I want to change things up a little bit. Possibly. How am I going to do that? I don't know. Can I not move it back? Great.
the hell? God damn it. Can I push it? Dude, I think I broke it. I may have broken the game. Nope, I just had to pull it that way. Alright, for some reason I couldn't... For some reason I'd be on this side of the thing. I don't know why. Whatever. What's the rest of the wealth? Cast about this land, my friend. Oh, it's in this place. Yeah, I've been trying to think of how to change things up with my videos because, like I said before, this has been a pretty long let's play, and you know, I feel like most of it probably isn't that interesting, especially the exploration stuff. But you never know. What the hell? There's something in there. I missed it. <laughs> I missed the chest earlier. Alright. But it would be... I, I feel like it would be better if I, like... Just did a whole lot of editing on my stuff instead of just... Recording, like, all of it. You know, just uploading all of the recordings and stuff. You know, like, just highlight the boss fights or... Maybe start editing it based on the missions or the quest lines or something. So I don't have as many videos. I don't know, it's... Uh, it's kind of like that... Go. It's kind of like, do I want quality or do I want quantity? You know? Keep freaking opening the map instead of leaving the bird. Do I really want to collect all this goddamn crap? Because I really don't feel like it, you know? Also, why is this water green? I don't like the look of that. 